Type pools allows us to define non-predefined types. Combination of all such non-predefined types is known as type pool or type group. There are several type groups available in SAP. For example, about ends list, etc. If we want to use some custom types in various programs then we need not define them separately, we can simply create a type group in a BAP dictionary and use that in our programs. To use them in program we use keyword type pools. Hi there let me show you how our training courses work in this short sample lesson. Just follow the on-screen instructions. Welcome to the demo session of type pools. Go to transaction say 11, SE 11 is a about data dictionary transaction. ZGRP is a new type pool which we are creating. Write the short text and click on save button to continue. Always try to save in your own package, otherwise save into in a local object. As an example, I have created two constants. One thing that needs to be taken care of while declaring the structures, constants, etc. in type group is that every object must start with name of type group. In this example the constants that are declared starts with ZGRP. The system gives syntax error in case the above naming convention is not followed. Now save and active the type group. Type group has been successfully created. Enter the transaction code SC38 in command field. ZTEST type GRP is a program name and now click on to create button. The next screen appears where we can write our source code. Now save and active the program and click on execute button the given screen will be open. Program is execute successful. Thanks for watching. End of slide. Thank you.